Um, it's kind of about friends who hit, uh, you know, dire financial straits and uh, they kind of get the idea that maybe they could make a porno to get out of it and it kind of affects, you know, the, the state of their friendship, I guess. Well, I think, you know, we're a Puritan society and sex is sort of one of those final taboos and I think violence has always existed in movies. You know, you could kapow, punch, bang, bang. You know, it's a very masculine thing and men run everything. So men were okay with like hitting each other in movies. But you couldn't even kiss in a movie until like, you know, for 50 years. You want to make the type of movies that you like to go see and that's like the exact type of movie I like to go see. So uh, yeah, I'm shocked that they're letting us do it. <laughs> First of all, he's, a, he's an, a great American voice in filmmaking. I think he has a really specific, strong, point of view and he's a great writer first and foremost and he wrote great characters and so uh, but he wasn't really precious about it when we got there he was very easy and I think um, we just we created a little family on set and had a great time. Uh, I'm one of the actors in the porn movie and uh, I actually am the lucky one that gets paired up with Tracy Lords and have certain um, I think you can call it a love scene with her uh, magical very magical and uh, you know, what we did on camera will make my parents proud. I love that he gets Jason Mewes naked in every one of his films. I think that that's like, you know, a true sign of one of the Kevin Smith little icings. You know, you, you put the word porno in the title and it's going to sound a little shocking, but really it's just a love story with a lot of dirty sex. You know, it's a, it's funny, dirty, everything, everything somebody like me, you know, 20-something-year-old watches and is like, yeah. Yeah, sex and love.